working on my 2009 Chevy Cobalt and today I'm going to be replacing the vapor canister purge valve. The car currently has 370,513 miles on it. So here is the vapor canister purge valve and there's a couple lines running to it and then one electrical connection. And here is what the new part looks like. The symptoms of a bad purge valve are a check engine light with codes P0441, P0443, P0444, and P0445. Another symptom is uh, rough idling, hard starting, poor fuel economy. And then to test it, there's a few different ways, but to visually look at it, you want to make sure there's no cracks anywhere. And then uh, you can, when you have it off, if you blow through it and it doesn't let air through, then it's good. And if it, air just goes through, then you know it's bad. And then there's another way to test, test it. You can start up the car, take off. Take off the line. And when you first start it up, you shouldn't feel a vacuum until it warms up for a few minutes. And then you can hear it, hear it kicking on. So I'm gonna go and replace this one, uh, even though it appears to be good. Uh, this one's lasted over 370,000 miles. This one's lasted over 370,000 miles and I just replaced the vapor canister, the charcoal canister, so I thought I would replace this as well, just as a preventative. So the first line, you push on the white tab and it kind of pushes up this and lets it just slip right off. And the line that goes to the intake manifold just has this clip that slips down and you push it forward and it pulls off. That right there. And then there's one electrical connector. push the red tab down and it just pulls off. Pull that back a little bit and it slips right off. This little metal piece, just pull it down. I got a little pick from the bottom and just stuck it underneath there and pulled it down. The new one comes with a bracket, but it's a different kind of bracket. So I'm gonna reuse the original. There we go. 
go. Reconnect the lines. There we go. Connect the electrical connector. And this, this takes gases from your, your gas tank through the charcoal canister and injects it into the air, into the intake manifold and burns off, burns off that excess fuel vapors for better fuel economy and to reduce emissions. And that is replacing the purge valve in a Chevy Cobalt. So if you blow on this part right here, and if you blow on this part right here, and air comes out, then you know it's bad. If you like this content, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. canister purge valve controls the amount of fuel vapors that go from the charcoal canister into the engine. Typically they contain a magnetic coil, a spring, a plunger, which is a passageway to let fuel into uh, the engine. So I'm going to disassemble this real quick. This thing has lasted 370,000 miles.